hi guys just checking in again with you um today i am let's see five days post-op i have my boob job on monday i'm still quite a bit bloated um feeling pretty good kind of sore um but no longer on the narcotics and i had the pain um, pump catheter removed. That's the little hole. I had one on either side so that I could um, <clears throat> pump the pain medication um, to myself so the catheters were actually in and inside and around the implant and so whenever I had pain, bam, push the button, I was good to go. So I had that for three days three days um, and I was good so um, at night I did take a Percocet uh, pain medication um, just to help me sleep peacefully to fall off to sleep because it's kind of painful for me to lay down because I literally went from like nothing to these huge boobs so um, it was a little bit comfortable uncomfortable for me to get um, situated in bed um, initially so yeah I was taking the Percocet initially just to fall asleep and now I'm okay without that I am continuing on my um, herbal supplement um, and vitamins that the doctor um, prescribed to me it's Vitamedica and it's per um, it's post procedure and post trauma specifically formulated to help you heal quicker and so there's less occurrence of inflammation and scarring and um, speaking of which the incision sites they look kind of gnarly it's just the blood underneath I don't see I don't know if you can see this kind of like um, the plastic tape there that is tegaderm that goes over the incision there's actually sutures there that will dissolve and then after two weeks um, and my two-week checkup they'll remove those as well I can show you they have dropped um, quite a bit they're not as high as they were they've come down quite a bit um, but they are still like you can see they're still pretty high so they will again they'll drop into their pocket um, they're not as tight as they were they're starting to become a little squishy already which is pretty exciting and I can move them a little bit although it is tender um, and I don't want to move them too much they don't unlike the smooth um, implant they where they want you to massage um, multiple times a day they don't want that with the textured because they want you your um, your sorry the dog your body tissue to form a nice adhesion to the texture of the implant um, to prevent capsular contraction so um, yeah they're looking pretty good they're dropping a little bit I think a little more every day so that's great um, I will tell you oh my gosh if I could have invested in some kind of um, bubble to put myself in after my boob job I definitely would have done that my one-year-old um, jumped on the bed today and jumped right on my chest and I thought that I was gonna pass out the pain was nearly unbearable it took my breath away um, but there's no bruising no abnormal swelling everything looks okay so um, all in all I think they are looking good um, again I will keep you guys updated um, we are almost out a week, so um, I'll, like I said, keep you updated as I continue to heal and as I continue to progress. Um, I am not really sure about the bloating, how long this is going to last. can tell you that I'm not liking it. I'm a clean eater. Um, I keep my diet pretty regimented, and um, until the procedure, I was working out every day. So it's kind of a bummer. I can't wait to get back into my workout routine, but I feel kind of like a horse right now. Um, pretty bloated, but um, that's otherwise, other than a little bit of sensitivity here um, at the incision site um, and the fact that I'm bloated, I feel great. And the best part, I can wear halter tops and t-shirts without a bra. So very excited about that too. So. If you guys um, have any questions, uh, feel free to comment um, below, and I will be happy to answer this for you. Thanks, guys.